Hello guys, Himanshu here with a very useful tutorial. This time not very exciting but yeah, very useful. This will really enhance your workflow and also change your way of working. So today's tutorial about FX console from the video copilot. Ok so guys so enough talking and let's get started. Ok so hit the control and space bar to bring up the FX console uh, or you can go to settings and change the shortcut key. So these are pre-built shortcut keys uh, but you can also create your own shortcut keys if you want to. Okay, so hit the control and space again uh, and now you can search and apply the effects and presets directly. This is very handy instead of using effects and presets tab. I mean every time if you want to apply any effects you will have to go to effects and presets tab and search the effects and drag and drop onto the layer or double click on it. But now you have the effects console so just hit the shortcut and apply the effects very quickly. Ok so one of the best feature I like uh, is the you can create a shortcut for quick access on your favorite effects. Let me show you hit the shortcut and type in curves. So for creating the shortcut just right click on the effects and choose create shortcut so this will create a shortcut for your quick access another cool feature is the take a screenshot yeah so now you don't need to render out your one single frame or save as photoshop layer suppose if you working on the project and your client wants to know what is the progress of your project so now you can just take a screenshot and go to gallery and here is your snapshot you can copy and paste it in photoshop as well by the way the location of the screenshot is uh, here uh, you can choose your own folder if you want to so uh, with this checkbox on you will get the full resolution screenshot without losing your quality in case uh, if you forget to set the custom quality to full you can also save your screenshot to PNG or copy to clipboard for pasting in Photoshop or Illustrator. Another cool feature is you can favorite the effects. If you um, I want to apply the curves, so type in two words, see you. But this uh, shows up the particular. But I think curve should be appear before the other effects because this is more important than the others. So just right click and choose add to favorites. So curves is gonna pop up read. So next feature is uh, blacklist. If you are searching for glow, uh, just type in glow but FX console shows the star glow first. For this you can just simply right click and choose blacklist. So star glow no longer appear in search unless you go to the settings and delete from the blacklist menu set. Another cool feature is uh, override the effects. So if you type action ball hit enter so here's your PC action ball but what if you don't like default uh, effects so just add some more effects to it. After some tweaks, save this effect, just type one more time action ball and choose this as favorite and go to settings and choose new override 
and select the default ball that I just created hit ok and now you will type in action ball so it will bring the same setting as we tweaked this before I hope you guys found this video helpful and if you like it please subscribe to my channel and like this video and share as much as possible so bye everybody we will see you very next time